Hi there, Izzy from DigitalGoja.com show. Janie posted to our forum, how can I tell if a lens works for my camera because there are lenses that are for full frame and then there are lenses that are for crop sensor. Great question. Here's a perfect example. For example, I have right here a 5D Mark III, one of the more popular full frame cameras on the market and this one happens to have the proprietary 24 to 105. All of the Canon lenses that are meant for full frame are designated at EF. You'll notice that in your nomenclature on the lens. And then its baby brother here is a Rebel T6S, very popular camera. Again, now this one has an 18 to 135 EFS. That means that this lens is exclusively made for crop sensors like the Rebel series, the 60Ds, the 70Ds, the 7D Mark IIs. Now, Canon has a proprietary system, so they can in turn make it so that when you try to mount this lens onto this camera, it will not fit. You could force it, but you will damage both the lens and the camera. Now, the EF lenses will mount in the other fashion, so you will be able to put them onto your existing crop sensor cameras, but you won't have the same perspective. The manufacturers that make third-party lenses make the lenses available to mount on all cameras. But the way to designate which one is meant for a situation that is for full frame or a camera that is a crop sensor, we'll take a look at some of the more popular Tamrons. This one happens to be the 24-70 2.8. This lens is meant to compete against some of the original manufacturer lenses very well made and put together and they designate it as a DI which is their designation for full frame cameras. Now on the other hand they make the 18 270 f3563 very popular lens to compete against the original manufacturer lenses a nice all-in-one lens and to know the nomenclature they stated as a DI2 that means that this lens is exclusively made for crop sensor cameras like for example this Rebel now here's another popular aftermarket manufacturer this is Sigma this is one of their contemporary this is their 17 to 728 and they designate it as a DC DC is meant for crop sensor cameras like this if you go ahead and again the same thing with the Tamron you mount it onto your full frame camera you can but you will get vignette so that's why they give you the nomenclature designation of DC which is for crop sensor and then in turn this is one of their more popular super fast prime zoom lenses their new 24 to 35 f2 and this is designated as a DG that means that this lens is meant for full frame cameras again it can be mounted the other way onto a crop sensor but you will get a different perspective in the lens and if you mount the crop sensor on the full frame you will get vignette so notice the designation on the lenses and do a little bit of research you'll notice that they do have the proper information on the nomenclature to let you know whether this lens is a viable product for your full frame camera or your crop sensor camera if you like this video click on the like button underneath and remember subscribe to our channel happy shooting